Yo, Sue, check it out. 2004 Acura TSX, 2.4 liters. Got it for 1,500. And it was 1,500 because it was not running, apparently. It wouldn't start. But boom, when I got there, turned the key, turned right on. Got that magic touch, I guess, who knows. The owner was like, with the seller was like, oh wow, what'd you do? I was like, I didn't do anything, I just turned the key. But yeah, for 1,500 bucks, pretty pretty good. And it ran, ran home. I was planning to have my brother tow it with like a car dolly rented rented from U-Haul, but got there started, got the paperwork done, and then freaking drove it home. It was on like a two mile drive, so yeah. Dang, from this angle it looks even better with the sun, but yeah, it needs a good cleaning. There was a little dent there, I didn't notice that, what the heck? <laughs> Hopefully we can get that out. Dent out, but yeah. Look at that, dual muffler, zoom, dang. It looks good, that's stock too, I think. I'm pretty sure it's stock, I don't know. Uh, my first freaking Acura car here. But yeah, I love the stock rims, stock mufflers. I like the lights, the front headlights. But yeah, Acura is the luxury version of Honda, so. I've been kind of looking out for like a Lexus because that's the luxury version for the Toyota. And then I didn't really want on Q Infinity because that's not as reliable, they say. But yeah, definitely an Acura or a Lexus. But yeah, I'll show you why it was so cheap too. Oh, sweet. If you didn't know, if you don't know, the thing is right here. It's a weird little latch for the Acura here but yeah the problem is one the power steering is leaking and then two the motor mount one second but yeah here's the motor mount that's the first thing I noticed massive crack right there in the back and below that part and the power steering is leaking right here oh, or my finger right here this is this is a gasket leaking right there yeah so if i turn it on it'll start leaking it'll start having a little puddle right there and then it leaks on into the belt it leaks onto the and the belt spreads it and then it leaks onto the alternator i just wiped it down when i got back when i drove it back now but yeah so, so for the so the, for the first drive i had to drive it from the place where i bought it from to my apartment and then i wanted to bring it to my parents place to where I can have a garage and then I can I have all, all my tools here so it was quite a scary ride it was definitely clunking right there making noise looks like some people over or misfilled it oh I didn't know most acro center there nice I had to shine that up more but yeah VTEC and yeah quite excited for this little project but yeah um, Amazon's a little late because with the little warehouse bug or something like that there's on the loose I don't know but then it was supposed to be here yesterday, but then it was not. So I thought I, would have, I was going to go to O'Reilly's to buy some parts, but then it's coming in today. So nice. But yep, we'll see. Hopefully this is the only problems. But yeah, AC does work. It is a clean title. Um, they didn't have the title at first, so I was, I was scared that maybe they didn't know it was possibly a salvage, but it is a clean title. AC does work. And uh, yeah, everything checked out, so nice all right yeah that's it we'll see once i finish this um power steering and the motor mount we will uh see what else if, if any chicken light pops on or anything if not boom straight to the smog and we'll be good to go but yeah until then soon peace